Alright. We're back. We're going through this door now. Oh, me, I'll be faced first in the zombies. Nope. Oh, bugger that. Uh, yeah, let's go the other way. I remember reading somewhere there was a spade key over there. No, nah, bugger that. <laughs> let's go do that first. I like the sound of her boots on the ground on that floor there. Like, like rubbery soles scuffing. Um, I'm not gonna really care about getting like a, a massively great ranking if I can get like a an A or a B. I'm fine with that. Man, she's so serious looking. Let's see where she points. She points up. All right. Go. Always start running just before they drop, I think. Alright, we go about this way. No hands. No hands. Sorry. Yeah, I think there was at least one spade key in this area. That might not be it. It's locked. Okay, that's the diamond, so it's upstairs. Nope, not there. Nope. Also, uh, they mentioned the whole uh, new Silent Hill game with the whole soft re reboot thing. I just really hope Konami does it in-house. Because after the first four games, it just got sloppy with the um, other studios they used. You know, European there and that and this there. And it's like they almost... What the hell? Oh. Hey. Yeah, he's dead. Where the hell did she go? I'll use the spade key. She must have gone through the duct next to the door. Was she like MacGyver or something? Leon! Claire, you made it! Yeah. Have you seen a little girl around here? Yeah, you just missed her. Who is she? I don't know. But it's too dangerous for her to stay here alone. Leon, I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Of course. But before I forget, here's a radio. That way we can keep in touch if something comes up. Alright, well that exchange I just watched must mean I went the right way. Uh, no, okay. The me was, uh, click a really nice button in the shorts. I know it probably sounds sexist. And honestly, don't care. I'll read that again. Ah, uh, the door is nailed shut. It doesn't look like I can pass through here. There's a hole under that door, though. What's this? Hang on a minute. Nice. I guess that's my reward for saving the little girl. What is this? Nothing? Right. Let's see if there's anything else here. No. No? Alright. So, is that the only door there? Map. Uh, yep. Just gotta go the other way. Should really re uh, reload my handgun, I think. Um. 
Should have actually probably got rid of that rocket launcher. Or grenade launcher, I should say. What's this? This dusk is locked. We use the lock. Yep. What do they get? Ooh! Flame rounds. Nice. Is there nothing there? Alright. What's this? At least I know it's up here. I read somewhere online though, um, I think it was says, um, when creating herbs, if you create green, blue, and then red in that sequence, um, it gives you limited invulnerability, Blah. it makes you impervious for a very short time. So, um, I think that's cool. I want I want to try that actually. They say it's good for um, oh god, where is it? Um. Bearing round use for grenade launcher, okay. I wanna see oh um uh, I wanna see what this does. So I wasted one round. That's fine. What does this take me? Seems to be broken, it won't work. Okay. Rusted gear, what's that? Uh, it's a strange square hole. Okay. Is that it? Alright, there's nothing here then. Well, I'm glad I got rid of that liquor at least. Let's see what else is up here. What's the door I came out of? No, nothing else. No, okay, there's nothing else. Superhero landing. What's it say? Uh, it's a bronze plate with a picture on it. So two blank, two, two blank, two. Okay. Alright. Yes. Alright, well, I was partially in position now. Ah, no, bollocks. That was wrong. That's it. One more. This one. Right. Oh. It's a thing. Joe is making a thing. It's got lights and string and goes big. Sorry, it's from a Doctor Who audio. 
Uh, will you take the serpent stone? Why not? It looks lovely. Might be good, tasty, fun. That stone. Alright, so we came in through that door there. Is there anything over here? No. There, that's the way. Um, I'm just wondering what could be out here now. Liquors are on the top floor. Oh! How many are there? I hear two more footsteps. Dead. Oh, wrong button. Yeah, he's dead. It's over here. Nothing. Is that two more here? Yeah, why not? I like his stance. Ah, uh, combine. Ah, bugger, that was a bad shot. I guess down is only for when they're like, within that kind of distance, really. I can still hear that other one. Probably like a gaggle of zombies in here. Oh no, there isn't. Brilliant. It's funny, it's like um, the waiting room of the first floor. Ooh, it's a lighter. Nice, I know where that goes. I can't carry any more items, okay. Let's get rid of some bollocks. Uh, get rid of that for now. Uh, the rounds too. Get rid of that. Uh, the stone, I don't think I need that now. Actually, no, I, I screwed up, hang on. I want the rocket launcher because... The grenade launcher, I should say. That. Sekiro Tiri's Diary A. Alright. April 6th. I accidentally moved one of those stone statues on the second floor when I learned leaned against it. When the chief found out about it, he was furious. I swear, the guy nearly bit my head off. Screaming at me, at me no, uh, never to touch the statue again. If it's so important, then maybe he should have put it out in the open like that. April 7th. I heard that all that and our pieces from the Chief's collection are rare items, literally worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. I don't know which is the bigger mystery, where he finds those tacky things, or where he's getting the money to pay for them. 
I wasn't uh, May 10th. I wasn't surprised to see the chief came in today with yet another large picture frame in his hands. This time it was really disturbing painting depicting a nude person being hanged. I was appalled by the expression on the chief's face as he leered at the painting. Why anyone would consider something like that to be an artwork, uh, a work of art is beyond my comprehension. All right. I can concur with you there. Alright, let's get rid of the, um... Yes. Checking the memory. Alright, um, so... This way. Open that up. Sorry. Alright. Well, I know where the lighter goes. But one thing I don't know is where this door goes. So, can I go in it? Knowing this, it'll be a, a really dumb mistake. Yeah. Dumb idea. in there so we might have mapped it. So there's two doors on both ends of the corridor. Alright. Um, what's my ammo? Um, no, let's go this way. We're gonna get that other red stone. Get the other red stone and just have a look. I'm on the second floor right now, so I should be able to maybe get that. Looks like a, an escape ladder down. Zombies. I find that funny in the first Resident Evil movie. They actually went to the trouble to um, an emergency ladder. You, you have to press the button. Uh, they went to the trouble to have that one scene where they walk out of a, an area and then walk back into the area to find no bodies whatsoever. Like someone's come with, uh, we go down like this. Like someone's come along with a, a mop broom and bucket and a big bin and just picked all the bodies up and cleaned up for them. I find that hilarious. Um, what's that? Oh, okay, that's the door where Marvin is. That's oh, still locked. So, let's try to think. I haven't taken many hits yet, though. Not in this se um, section. I mean, I've taken a bite or two, but. I can hear them. God, that just sounds so gross in my headphones. Saliva. Straight ahead, isn't he? Shut up, you want to be Velociraptor. Alright. No hands. Maybe it only happens the once as a jump scare and never again. Seems to be the case. It's up this way. Uh, gotta keep remembering press X to go up. It's the same in um, Code Veronica 2 uh, when I tested that for PS2. Code Veronica, you gotta press X to go up the stairs too. I, whenever I get a new game, or not a new new game, but a game, it's like one of these. I like to test them to make sure, you know, they're good and not bug it up or anything. And, um, yeah. Code Veronica, you gotta press X to go up and down stairs. I only played, I think it was maybe the first five or six minutes. I didn't, um, didn't save or anything. 
It's just the thing I do. I just like to test my stuff out. Was it up this way? Leon's gone. Might be through here, I can't remember. Might have been on the other side. No, it wasn't on the other side. Oh, bloody hell. Where was it? I'm in the library. It's all the way I came. Might be upstairs. I miss a map button. It's one thing I really miss. Whatever happened to the old good-fashioned map button? Still here. I think it might be down here. Nope, that's the clock tower. I think that's the clock tower actually. I don't know what they call it. It looks like a clock tower to me. No door. Alright. So it's something else, somewhere else. Remember. Um fast way down. Hey, yeah, she made it that long. Unless it's on the second floor. No, nope, what that mean? Do what I mean, not the character in the game. Alright, there's no door over here. other rooms that I, I just ran past like the it's not the stars office because I'm trying to remember for the life of me where the hell because I know for a fact I haven't been on the other side of the, of the building yet because on the top floor, on the bottom floor, I walk in, there's a whole bunch of zombies, I'm like, nope. Not today, thanks. Let's just check the star's office. It's not here, it'll be in that other office downstairs. No, there's nothing there. Alright. Didn't kill me to check, so... soon. Gotta go for a 12 week scan soon too. Come on, down you go. Down, there we go. It's a room with an extra bit to it. So, I don't want it. No, okay. There's no uh, 180 turn in this game. Just check that in for sure. Nope, locked diamond. Okay. So, it must be like uh, that door right near where the liquor is. Might be 
here. Yes, it's here. Really. Do I keep the lighter? Yes, use. Cool. Oh, the fire burned out. Yes. Alright. Wonder where else I can set fire to. I guess that's the whole point of that room then. Dealt with and done. Sorry about the whole running around, but my memory isn't what it used to be. That way. Sometimes I have to write notes down for things. But, um. Uh, It's, it's okay. Let's check the map here quickly. Where am I? Alright, so there's that room there. It's blank. Yes, I can go in there. Yes. Oh! Alright. Damn it, I kept the key. Oh, what's this? Hey, Claire's gonna try to copy her butt. It's a copy machine. No, I should better not get in trouble. Not in a police station. What's this? Ink ribbon. Do I want the ink ribbon? No. I want to see if there's anything important in this room first. I've made what two saves I think. Alright, so to the left and run. Oh, he's really fast. Stop booking it. So if you're watching this video and you like Resident Evil and all that question for you. Are you upset by the fact that in Resident Evil 1 movie they didn't have any of the actual characters from the game? I don't think we need this anymore. Um, put that there. Put the red jewel there. Put those there. Um, let's get rid of that piece. I don't need it. Alright, are you upset by the fact that they didn't have any original uh, uh, any characters from the game at all in there. Because, all right, I've played a little bit of Resident Evil One. I will admit that uh, the remade version, and um, I don't want to say, but yeah, I I didn't like the fact that it wasn't based in the mansion. It wasn't. Uh, characters that I knew, I fit, felt no interest in them, to be honest. Let's see if I can clear this area. Oh. 
Come on. That one went up. Oh, half a zombie. Is that it? Damn. Yep. Yeah. Right, love you. I'll, I'll, I'll see you in a minute. I'm still recording. Right, love you. I go through all that ammo? No, I still got one left. Lovely. Alright. Well, I'm standing in the ruins of those zombies just now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to end the recording here. This will be video number two for today. Uh, I'll be back in a second. I'll catch you guys in a minute. See ya.